Twizzlers. Today's video is a Twizzlers fishing challenge. And yes, you heard that correctly. Twizzlers fishing challenge. I'm sweating. Whew. I just came in from actually finishing this Twizzlers fishing challenge. And I can tell you right now we have ourselves a doozy. Yes, I said doozy. I don't know if anyone still says doozy or if anyone really ever said doozy, but uh, I just said it. So, hey, we got ourselves a doozy. And uh, I might try to bring that back. I like the sound of doozy. <laughs> Anyways, all right, so if you're new to the channel, you might want to smash that subscribe button and hit that notification bell so you can be notified every time I post a new video. And if you hit that like button, it's supposed to help out my videos a lot. I know sharing the video also helps out my videos a lot. So if you guys want to do that, that would be greatly appreciated. If not, I completely understand. You know, you just want to watch a video. All right, but I will say this. You might want to know this. This might, this might be to you. This, this might appeal to you. You right there. So when I hit the 1,000 subscribers mark, I am giving away a reel. And when I hit the 2,000 subscriber mark, I am giving away a reel. And I'm probably going to set other goals, 5,000, 10,000, whatever. And I'll probably be doing giveaways at those marks as well. So I am going to try and do giveaways throughout my YouTube experience. So if you subscribe now and I'm still around that 1,000 subscriber mark, Heck, you could be an OG subscriber. And uh, I might be spoiling something here a little bit, but at the same time, I think my thumbnail's probably gonna have a picture of a bass with some Twizzlers, so maybe I'm not spoiling anything. But we successfully complete this challenge. Not only do we successfully complete this challenge, I mean, dang, we successfully complete this challenge. I mean, we, we blow the challenge out the water, okay? We catch a bunch of fish, I'm not gonna say how many, you're gonna have to watch the video to see. And we catch ourselves a pretty dang good one. All right, let's get into this Twizzlers fishing challenge video. I hope you guys enjoy it. Remember, smash that subscribe, <laughs> smash that subscribe button, hit that like button, all that good stuff. All right, all right, enough of me talking. Get into the video and go. Oh, oh, I just got bit. Holy cow. Is my, is it still there? Oh, oh. It took the Twizzler. Holy cow, I think that was my third cast. Oh my goodness. Oh my goodness. I think he liked it. I think he liked the Twizzler. <laughs> You're shaking your reel like that. Oh, yeah. Kind of looks like a normal wacky rig setup. Oh, got one, got one. No way. <laughs> Dude, I just adjusted the camera. Oh my goodness. Got one on the Twizzler. <laughs> Challenge complete, but you know what? Dang, he barely was hooked. You know what? We completed the Twizzler challenge, but we're not done. We're not done. We're gonna see if we can't catch one a little bigger than this. Pretty cool though. <laughs> All right, so I'm on the other side of the pond now. I think I'm in a more high percentage area of where a bigger bass will be. I, I actually am kind of surprised how quickly we caught that one, but it's been a little while. We haven't caught one since that one little dink. A dink, I mean, yeah, we passed the challenge, but do we really want to finish this video just with a dink caught on a Twizzler? No, no, we don't. <laughs> so let's catch a big bass with a Twizzler. That would be pretty awesome. Oh, there's a giant bass near it. What? What? Was that a bass or was that a giant soft shell turtle? That thing was huge. Oh, I spooked it. That was a bass. Oh my goodness. Dang it. Yeah, a bass followed it in, but then decided not to get it. I wonder if it will come back for it. Is it? 
this one. Got one. Oh, that was working. Oh, it came off. Did my hook break off? Oh, shoot. <laughs> no, my hook's still there. Twizzler came off, but my hook's still there. A little better right there. Not a giant, but on the Twizzlers. <laughs> All right. I don't know if a big bass is going to bite this, to be honest. <laughs> like, one rod was smart. He did his challenge on a golf course pond. Uh, this is probably the closest thing to a golf course pond that I can fish. So, I'm trying to be smart like one rod. If you, you don't know, one rod, one real fish, and he did a challenge like this. He probably was the first one to do this challenge. Alright, so I want half of this. So, I'm going to fold this in half like so and that is where I'm gonna break it in half then I'm gonna find the halfway point right there and put this bad boy on there like so I have one o-ring after this so uh, I hope I don't lose this o-ring oh there's a big old bass right here no freaking way Oh my goodness, where'd he go? He saw me and he got spooked. So that giant bass might have went out this way. Maybe he feels safer out in that open water and he'd be more likely to bite out there, I don't know. Oh, did I just get bit? Yep, there's a fish. Oh, it's a good one. It's a good one. <laughs> All right. <laughs> Not a bad little bass. Not a bad little Twizzler bass. Actually, he's kind of heavy. Even though he's not huge, he's, he's kind of heavy. But that's on the Twizzler, baby. The Twizzler. <laughs> All right, let's release him. Oh, yeah. All right, so we've caught three bass on the Twizzler so far, and it's gone from dink to a little better than a dink than a not bad one. Now let's try and catch a giant. That would make this challenge so sweet if we caught a big one. We're definitely gonna try and catch a big one. I can't guarantee it, but we're gonna try. And uh, what was really good about that last catch is we still have our O-ring and we still have this Twizzler. They seem to bite that smaller Twizzler profile pretty well. So I think we're gonna stick with this approach. All right, let's try to catch another one. But we did just see a giant bass in here that's no longer in here. There's tons of bait fish in here, tons of small fish, maybe even small bass. Uh, and if that's the case, if that giant bass was a male, if that was a male guarding, there's gotta be some ginormous females in here. You know, maybe even getting close to that 10 pound mark. I did catch a seven pounder in here, by the way, people. This 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 pond is no joke. There are some big fish in here. Oh, got another one! Oh, 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 <laughs> oh my goodness! <laughs> another one, back to back cast, baby. <laughs> back to back cast. That's a nice side of the mouth hook set on them. Man, they. I think I figured out how to fish this bait. <laughs> that one looks pretty good to me. I'll toss them back in here. <laughs> All right. Let's try and catch another one. All right, there it goes. Whew. I actually think there might be some shallow over there. Oh, did I hit a bass? Seemed like something spooky. Yeah, it did. That's a bat. It's a good one. It's a good one. This is what we've been looking for, guys. This is what we've been looking for. Get over here. Oh my goodness, it's fighting. Stay hooked, stay hooked, stay hooked. Oh, it's digging in the grass. Get up out of there. Yes, yes, yes. <laughs> On the Twizzler, baby. On the Twizzler. <laughs> Check it out, still in his mouth. On the twist, oh, ho, ho, ho. <laughs> on the twizzler. All right, let me grab this. Let me grab this. Man, I had him hooked good. 
on the Twizzler, baby. Yeah, it's a good bass. Nice bass on the Twizzler, baby. Nice bass on the Twizzler. <laughs> oh, man. This is going perfect. You know, we caught, what, five fish now? And we just been getting bigger and bigger. That time, it was nothing to do with technique. The second my lure hit the water, I saw a swirl, and I was like, oh, there's a bass right there. And then, like, as I was kind of tightening my line and trying to feel if it was there, at first I didn't feel him there. And then I was like, oh, wait, yeah, there's a big bass there. <laughs> So on the Twizzlers, baby, the Twizzlers. <laughs> All right, let's release them and try to catch another big one, an even bigger one. I'm telling you, I caught like a seven plus pounder out of here. So <laughs> there's even bigger ones than this. Whew, that one was up shallow. All right, let's put them back. <laughs> All right, I think the smaller one actually kind of wiggles more like a, uh, like like a stick bait's supposed to wacky rig. The smaller one had a little bit of flutter on the ends. Maybe that's why I'm just getting a lot more bites. It actually looks like uh, how a wacky rig stick bait's supposed to look. There's a that soft shell turtle's right here. He's coming up on land. Y'all see him? He's right next to me. What is he doing? That's so weird. Oh, got one. Oh, it's a good one. Oh, it's a better one. That's the best one. That's the best one. Oh. Oh, look at that monster. Holy cow. Holy cow. <laughs> Check that out, guys. Oh, dang. Still has the Twizzler right there spinning around near his mouth. Oh, my goodness. Oh. Oh. Jeez, he ripped my freaking hand apart. Ugh. Oh, I don't have my scale with me. <laughs> oh, it never fails. I never. This is this 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 is this is this is a big bass on the Twizzlers, baby. On the Twizzlers. Check out that bass on the Twizzlers, baby. Oh my goodness. Oh my goodness. Oh, Jesus hurt my Damn, he ripped my finger apart. You see that blood on my finger? Sucker's ripping me apart. All right, it's raining. It's raining as I'm releasing him. Look at that big fella go. Woo! <laughs> it just started raining on us too. We got to get out of here. Oh my goodness, that bass was big. On the Twizzlers, baby. On the Twizzlers. That was like, what, six bass? I don't even know. And they just got bigger and bigger and bigger and finally we caught that monster. This was like a perfect day. The Twizzlers was the sauce. It was the secret juice. It was everything. They just wanted that red Twizzler today. Oh my goodness. <laughs> I hope you guys enjoyed this video. We do a lot of videos like this on Real Journey, and by we, I mean me. But hey, if you like this video, if you like videos like this video, make sure you hit that subscribe button. Make sure you smash that subscribe button. Make sure you hit the like button if you like this video. Comment below. I respond to my comments. And yeah, once you hit that subscribe button, then you gotta hit that notification bell. Cause once you do that, you're notified every time I post a cool video just like this. And I'm gonna make sure I drop as many of these as I can. And you know, comment below any ideas you have for me for any videos. Just comment anything, I, I'll respond. All right, I'm getting dumped on. I don't want my audio equipment to get messed up. It's been real, another day, another journey, another real journey, and we're out. Deuces.